welcome to bsc statistics students so in this class i explain rules for determining schadel point what are the rules for obtaining the schadel point first one select the minimum element of each row of the path matrix and mark them by circle okay so you have to what you have to do is so you have to consider every particular row for each and every particular row you have to calculate the minimum element of the path matrix uh, in the path matrix and we have to mark it with circle the second uh, second step or uh, the second uh, point select the greatest element of each column of the path matrix that is uh, the maximum element of the path matrix in the column for each column and mark them by an rectangle that is uh, by taking some uh, square box okay you have to unrectangle this uh, you have to identify the uh, the maximum element of each column in the path matrix and then you have to unrectangle the respective element that is the second uh, point and the third point uh, if you observe the third point here if there appears an element in the path matrix uh, marked by both circle and unrectangle that is the square box then the position of that element is the schadel point of the path matrix so so simple that is uh, if you uh, uh, an element uh, which consists of both that is both circle and and rectangle and uh, that position of the uh, position of the element uh, uh, in that path matrix is known as the schadel point is called schadel point right so for example you see the one particular problem here uh, in this particular problem, you see the solve the following game whose path matrix is given by the path matrix is uh, for player A. Uh, a is having player A is having two strategies, and player B also ha having two strategies B1, B2. Uh, then what you have to calculate? This is the matrix you have to consider. This is payoff matrix, which means uh, if player A uh, employs the strategy A1. Uh, uh, then uh, player B replaced with B1, then player A will get 5 rupees gain and player B replaced with B2, the 5 rupees uh, gain to player A. Like that, these are all payoffs of player A only. That is 5 rupees gain, 4 rupees gain, 2 rupees gain, 3 rupees gain to the player A because all the elements are positive. If any element is negative, then uh, which are uh, uh, gain to the player B and loss to the player A. Okay. So, this is what the problem, payoff matrix. Uh, so for which you have to calculate uh, schadel point to calculate the schadel point first of all it is it requires to calculate row minima you have to write it right here um, uh, and so that you have to calculate for first row minimum element 5 4 the minimum is 4 you have to circle here you have to circle here and then uh, you have to consider is for second row second row the minimum element is 2 you have to circle here Okay, and after that, uh, uh, we have to consider player uh, that is column for player B. First column, you have to consider maximum. Uh, you have to unrack rectangle 5. And uh, for uh, uh, second uh, column that is uh, 4, 3, the maximum 4, you have to unrack rectangle. And then uh, uh, what you have to do is you have to see whether, uh, first of all, uh, uh, Row after row minima, so you have to calculate um, the maximum element uh, in the row minima. These are the row minima 4 and 2. The maximum is this. So, circle and and rectangle and uh, maximum value, you write maximum mu underscore. Similarly, column maxima, so you have calculated 5 and 4. Then uh, we have to calculate uh, uh, among these maximum elements, you have to calculate minimum element that is among 5 and 4, the minimum is 4. This is called mini max value and this is denoted by mu under mu upper score mu upper score then uh, which particular element having the both circle and and rectangle in the matrix uh, you have to observe here that is here in the uh, in the four the element in the position a1 comma b2 therefore a1 comma b2 is the schadel point it coincides you see here it is written clearly the maximum value is equal to mu underscore is equal to 4 Minimax value mu upper score is equal to 4 again. The, this is maximum minimax values are 4 and which coincides uh, um, which are equal 
and which coincides at the point a one comma b two. Therefore, the Schadl point uh, exists and it is uh, uh, the position a one comma b two. The a one comma b two is known as the Schadl point. The optimal strategies of player A are uh, A1 and uh, player B or B2. So A1, B2 are is the Schadl point which gives everything optimal strategies and uh, uh, maximum value, minimax value, of which is the value exist at the Schadl point. Uh, that is uh, maximum and minimax values uh, and and everything. That is uh, the value of the game is equal to mu is equivalent to be uh, four is equal to mu mu underscore is equal to mu upper score is maximum minimax. Uh, Which is equal to value of the game. That is four. So this is what how to calculate uh, uh, maximum, minimax values and Schadl point. So these are the rules for determining the Schadl point. Hope you understand. Thank you. Thank you very much.